Hello everyone. Let's solve this caselet. It says there are five students. They were detained from their semester examinations and they had a very low attendance in one of the subjects. And they were detained in five different subjects. These are the name of the subjects. And uh, the number of classes taken of these subjects were among these numbers 28, 24, 20, 18, and 16. And uh, these students attended a different number of classes in the respective subjects. So, for example, some person must have been detained in finance. The total number of classes must have been one of these values. Okay. And uh, that person attended a different number of class uh, in that subject. Okay, uh, so an interesting fact that was noted was that the ratio of classes taken to classes attended was an integer less than or equal to four for each of these students. So these students attended certain number of classes. Okay, and this ratio of classes taken to classes attended, let us say, uh, let us say 24 classes were taken. Okay, and a person could have attended, uh, see, let's say six eight classes right so the ratio comes out to be four or three okay so like this uh, this ratio existed okay and all the ratios were integer less than or equal to four now certain more information is given that classes taken in marketing six more and uh, who we attended the least number of classes and all these information given to us okay so we shall make a table like this so first would be the number of classes okay then we will put attendance that how many classes did that person attend then you can put the num name of the person okay and the subject okay so we shall have a table like this so these numbers are 28 24 20 18 and 16 Okay, now this ratio is given to us as that integer less than or equal to 4. Less than or equal to 4 means maximum 4. Okay, so for 28, the attendance could be. Uh, now, one information given here is the maximum number of classes attended by any of these students was 9. So, maximum attendance is 9. So, ratio is maximum 4, the attendance is maximum 9. Okay, so this person could is the only person who could have attended nine classes. Okay, because that is the maximum number. Because all others are not divisible by nine. Now, 28, if we talk about the attendance, can be only seven. So, if you take what are the factors of 28, that factors are two, four, seven, 14, etc. Okay, so if you take two, the ratio becomes 14. For four, the ratio becomes seven. For 14, the ratio becomes 2, right? And all of all, it is also given that maximum classes attended was 9. Okay, so this person must have attended 7 classes. Okay, now 24, if you see the factors, uh, the ratio is uh, maximum 4. Okay, so minimum attendance would be 6. Then attendance could be 8 also because 3 ka ratio is 12 is not possible. Okay. For 20, if we take 4 as the number of classes attended, the ratio becomes 5. So, ratio should be 4. So, we can only take the number as 5. Okay. Now, for 16, the number of classes can be 4 or 8. Right. Because if we take 4, the ratio is 4. For 8, the ratio is 2. Okay. Now, let us put the information given. Uh, classes taken in marketing are 6 more than those in HRM. Marketing is 6 more than HRM. So, if we see the difference of 6, it exists between 24 and 18. So, this must be marketing. This must be HRM. Okay. Bhuvi attended the least number of classes, but the subject in which he was detained did not have the least number of classes. So, now out of these attendance thing, the least numbers are, if you see that if we can, one possibility is 4, right, we can put 4 here. But it is given that the subject in which he was detained did not have the least number of classes. So, he cannot be detained in this subject. Now, out about apart from 4, the least possibility is 5. So, this is Bhuvi attending 5 classes. Okay. So, this means this is not 4. So, this will be 8. Okay, and if this is not 8, this will be 6 because it is given that 
each of them attended a distinct number of classes okay so this number will be 6 so we get the unique number of attendance also okay next is uh, maximum we have already considered this and the difference between the number of classes taken in finance and operations is half of the difference between the classes of the subjects in which duty and le were dated okay now finance and operations see uh, we we know marketing and hrm now finance and operations the numbers left are see the numbers left are 28 20 and 16 okay so if we take 28 20 the difference will come as 8 if we take 28 and 16 the difference will come as 12 if we take 20 and 16 the difference will come as 4 okay so it is saying this difference is half of the difference between duty and le right so duty and le the difference should be double so that is 16 24 or 8 okay now 16 is not a difference right maximum difference is 12 so only one case exists that 4 and 8 okay so finance and operations the number the difference should be 4 so that means only possibility is 20 and 16 so this is finance and operations okay now this gives us uh, your uh, this thing this subject which will be itm Okay, this subject is ITM. Now, uh, duty and LE, the difference is 8. So, it is saying the, the difference is uh, between the classes of the subjects in which duty and LE were detailed. So, the difference is 8. Now, the difference is 8 possible between 28 and 20. Okay, but 20 is already filled. Okay, uh, next difference could be 24 and 16. So, these values are 24 and 16. So, let us put duty and LE like this the very next statement says le was not detained in marketing right so that means this is duty and this is le and let us also write these numbers so we have filled this information now we are left with a and c okay Avi and Bhuvi were detained in operations and ITM in no particular order, right? So, Bhuvi is detained in, we are given finance or operations. So, he must be detained in operations. So, Bhuvi is detained in operations, okay? And Avi must be in, Avi must be detained in ITM. So, this is Avi, okay? And this will be C, okay? So, this is how we complete the table, okay? Now, we can answer the questions. Who among the following attended the maximum number of classes? So, maximum number of classes was attended by Chavi. What is the ratio of classes to attendance for LE? So, 16 ratio 8, the ratio is 2. How many classes were taken of operations? So, operations there were 20 classes. In which subject was duty detained? So, duty was detained in marketing. So that is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.